Uh, I think Porsche has a pretty storied past. The lifestyle um, and the, the love affair with Porsche as a brand and as a product has been there through and through. And then when you weave in motorsport, the roots are pretty deep. To be an ambassador of the company that really races and puts out awesome product on the road, it's pretty special. The brand Porsche, it always was an intelligent, specific experience. They were lightweight, they were smart in how they made their performance. To be connected to a brand that's sort of synonymous with some of those attributes, it's a great thing. Uh, at this point, I own 911s from almost each decade, and uh, to sample those cars and to tell that story to people who are from outside the world of Porsche, that's the fun part. My involvement with Project Cars came from a very pure driver-engineer relationship, working with them on tuning Porsche's products to relate back to the user in the crispest and most authentic way. Critical feedback and what is needed to improve the car on the road. And that's something I do day in and day out. Doing it from a simulation aspect with AJ and the Project Car Guys, that's unique for me. To be on the software side, it's really a behind the scenes. Overall grip, is that right? A little bit on some of the suspension and tire models, trying to get the realism as high as possible. It's pretty natural to just jump right in, get my hands dirty with their engineers, and tell them where I thought they were nailing it on the product and connecting the real feelings and emotions and handling to a GT3 RS or a 936 race car. What I quickly realized is that driving some of these cars was bringing that same engagement, that same challenge, that same connection that I love about vintage racing. You know, I found myself looking back at Rod, thinking to myself, you guys, you're, you're doing this. I mean, this is what I want. Captivating experience of vintage racing and how easily you could lose control of the car. Getting into $10 million vintage Le Mans winning cars, even for me, something that I'll never be able to do. I think there's a lot of people who can put their hands on this software, walk through the history of this company, tap into some of Porsche's racing heritage experience some of these cars that they might not ever get to physically, and I think that's one of the coolest parts of simulation. My name is Patrick Long. I'm a Porsche factory driver. <laughs>